I'm gonna kind of take you guys with me through my closet. I'm trying to decide if I want this one. Should we show everyone your closet? No. And all the clothes you no. need to get rid of? Okay, let's go right no. now. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> Here's Elijah's closet right here. I'm gonna show you guys a few things in my closet. He probably didn't jump because he was asleep the whole time. Hey, oh, be quiet. Oh, I watched her. it. Welcome to another vlog. You guys, today, you guys saw me cleaning in our cleaning video, the speed cleaning video the other day. We were cleaning our master bedroom. So it's kind of got me on like this cleaning spree right now because it's spring and I'm trying to like clear everything out. So right now, today, I am doing closets. So we're kind of going through and purging clothes out of our closets. And so with the help of Poshmark, you guys, we are going to sell some of these clothes that honestly I have a ton that have tags on them still that I've never worn or haven't worn forever or the kids haven't worn um, and we're gonna sell those on Poshmark it's like the easiest way to sell your items online so we're gonna do that I'm gonna kind of take you guys with me through my closet you guys probably saw our closet clean out way back when so you guys get to kind of see what my closet looks like now I'm gonna go through a few items and then place some for sale and place some just to donate. So this is what I have going on here right now, you guys. These clothes, I need to take pictures of, and I'll show you guys how to do it on Poshmark, but I need to take pictures of these, post them on Posh Poshmark, and then see if we can sell any. These are like, a lot of them, see it, like this one has tags, that one has tags, and then these are just like barely ever worn. This one has tags, isn't that cute? I'm kind of sad she never wore that, but we are gonna upload this onto Poshmark. Marks app. So if you guys are interested in doing this spring cleaning journey with us, you guys, you can upload this app as well and you can use the um, link in the description below. Check out that link. You can upload your own profile and, and just start, start going. And it's also an amazing place to shop because a lot of people are posting their different items on there as well. And of course, they're cheaper than what you would buy in a regular store or whatever. So check out that link if you guys are interested in doing this with me. Um, check it out, open your profile, and let me show you guys my closet. All right, you guys, so go upload the Poshmark app. We actually have a store there already with some items on it, so go check it out, go add us. We'll add you guys back, see what everybody's selling, get in on the spring cleaning together. It's gonna be awesome. Danny just got up out of his seat. Check this <laughs> his out. His editing seat. I already showed him. Isn't that so cute? You yourself <sighs> can get this for your kid. Yeah, that's this was true. Emberlin. <laughs> Isn't it, it was so going cute? To be for Emberlin. You, you guys. Get it. Now, and also, you know, you might be like, oh, you should just give it away or blah, blah, blah. But honestly, there's certain items that we all pay decent money for. And yeah. it's nice to get a little something back. We already donate a ton of clothes. I think I took like 20 bags like, like she had a couple the, months ago. The car, her car full, like all the back seats, yeah. everything. I vlogged so, it. <laughs> every once in a while, it's okay to do something like this. Yep. You have like the brand name things that are in decent shape and you're like, oh man, I spent 50 bucks on that and I just wore it three times. Then yeah. there's no reason why you shouldn't get 20 bucks. It's like doing a garage sale, but it's probably a little bit more upscale. You probably get more back from this um, than a garage sale. Yeah. A little, I just thought this was kind of cool because it still has the tags. Yeah, on. these both still have the tags. And so you enter in literally their size and all of that, but Little known fact, you guys, my favorite kind of clothes are clothes for 4th of July. Uh, it's like, it's literally one of my most favorite holidays. I'm kind of sad she didn't get that, but I think last year what happened is I got her a different one that I liked better, and so I never ended up returning that one. It just kind of sat in the corner, and when I cleaned the other day, I found it. So we're gonna sell that along with these items, along with items that we already have there on that app. Um, so go check it out. Let me show you my closet. All right, you guys, so here's my closet. If you guys haven't, it's still in pretty decent shape. Those are for more for sale items. These are some of the ones that are up on the app already, but this is not in too bad shape for as long as it's been since I've cleaned it. So you guys, go check out our um, closet clean out video because it was way, way worse than this before. So I just want to kind of go through my clothes. My rule is kind of, if you haven't worn it from for like eight, months to a year like get rid of it either donate it sell it whatever you need to do so i have purged most of it i do have more laundry i need to hang that's in the laundry but there are a few things like this little vest here i have not worn forever so i think well, it's a little ripped there and stuff but it's kind of the style of the vest so this one i'm probably going to donate just because it's still pretty good quality i got it at the buckle actually and um i feel like 
you could do something with that. I'm gonna donate this. I have a little donate pile here. Like I said, we already did a huge donation thing a few months ago, so I don't have a ton right now. Um, this one, I think I'm also gonna donate this one. I haven't worn it forever. And I probably won't. It's it's one of those like super clingy materials and it just like clings to every single like curve that I have, if you know what I mean. Um, I think I'm going to donate this one. It's still good quality. Um, I just don't know how much we would get for selling it anyway. And so I'm totally okay with donating this one. So there's that. And then let's see what else. Still like that. I don't know. Sometimes it's hard to get rid of stuff. There's really not much else I want to get rid of, I don't think. I've kind of gone through here to see what I like what I don't like, and I think for the most part, unless I miss something, I'm going to keep most of that. So, unless this one, I might not ever, I might sell this one actually. What brand is this? Oh, that's the Jennifer Lopez brand. This is actually a good shirt. I think I will sell this one. It's just, I probably will never wear it, honestly. I've worn it maybe twice. Actually, I think I wore it to Ellen when I went to Ellen one year. So it was like a special occasion, but I seriously haven't worn it since then. So I'm gonna add this in my uh, for sale pile because it's still super good quality. I actually really love Jennifer Lopez's um, clothing line. Um, I think it's still at Kohl's, I'm not sure. And then here's my dresses, the ones that aren't down in the laundry room. And it's hard for me to get rid of dresses because I don't, it's hard of, for to find dresses, number one, but just to, I don't know. Like I like to have as many dresses as possible because we wear them all the time for church, special events, things like that. So um, I do have a couple dresses out there. I'm trying to decide if I want this one. It's super cute. It's just a little tight than I like, but maybe I'll lose some weight. I don't know, you guys. I don't know. Okay, I think I'll keep that one. This one, kind of the same deal for this one. Boom. Although it's super flattering, it's just super tight, so it like clings. You know what I'm saying? Like, oh, I hate the clingage. I'm gonna keep it. I think I'm gonna keep it. I'm taking you guys with me on this. Let's see. I like that one still. Love this one. I don't know. I don't know. I actually think I'm going to... This is a Calvin Klein one. I think I'm going to sell this one. I don't ever... I, I've maybe worn this once for Christmas or something for church. Um, so I'm going to sell this one. Super good quality. It's Calvin Klein. Stretchy. Very nice. So I think I'm going to put that in my for sale pile. I have a lot of red right here, which is so funny. Look at that. I'm selling like all my red stuff. But this dress is super cute. I do like it. But again, it's clingy as well. So anyways, you guys, I'll kind of show you how the app works and how we post the items. It's honestly, it's super simple. You literally just take a picture, upload it to the thing, and then just kind of fill in the description and all of that. Super, super simple. Hey, Ash, what's Hi. up? <laughs> Ashlyn's hair is still so cute. Hasn't grown back yet. Nope. Are you used to it? No, How many of you went to our Facebook uh, yesterday and saw the flashback video I put up of Ashlyn? What? Oh, when she does the karate. Karate! Oh, oh I miss that, Ash. <laughs> <laughs> she was super cute. She was my hardest child, though, as a kid. Like, she just wanted to go everywhere and get into everything. So anyways, you guys, I'm gonna finish doing these closets. We gotta actually do Danny's closet because his, he's got way too many clothes. He's got a ton to go through. So we're, I think we're gonna try to do some of that today as well. And then if I can get to the kids' closets, I'll do that as well. And then Danny and I have date night tonight. So that's gonna be a nice little break from the cleaning and the regular stuff. So anyways, you guys, yeah. should we show everyone your closet? No. And all the clothes you no. need to get rid of? Okay, let's go right no. now. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. No. <laughs> Come on, Ash. No, oh. not in there. Why, it's not clean? Oh. <laughs> Do you have a ton of clothes to get rid of? Oh shoot, yours might be the last one we have to do. Should we give them a little sneak peek? No. Like open and close it real quick. Ready, oh no, that was too quick. Ready, go. Oh, oh. <laughs> the, the crazy thing is, is you have an awesome closet. If you it's just- It's not messy, it's just oh. clothes everywhere. Oh. <laughs> Because like I have stuff hanging and then I take it down because I don't want to wear it. So then you should just hang it back up. Oh, I don't think it's just clothes though. I have though. two hampers in here. You do? Okay, bye bye. <laughs> All right, I want to know how many of you think Danny's closet is in tip top shape as it was when he did the clean out. <laughs> is it, babe? 
He's ignoring me. He thinks he, he's acting like he can't hear me. I know he can, even though he has headphones on. <laughs> Don't shit. What's up? <laughs> Like my white. You're such a good faker. You like my white uh, beats or did, Ashlands. Did you hear anything I just said? No. Really? I promise. About your closet? Absolutely not. Oh, do you think it's it? I was asking them if they think it's in as much tip top shape as when you uh, did your makeover. It will be in about an hour. <laughs> You're going to clean it? Yeah. You're going to have time for that? Well, I've got to finish this edit. Show, I know. That's what so I'm I saying. Make sure you guys are happy by 4 o'clock. <laughs> That's right. Yeah. So if you haven't seen the cook with me that Danny did, go check that out. Yep. All right. All right, you guys. So this is how easy it is. Here is the Poshmark app. Those are my kids' apps. Um, and then it literally pulls up our store, and then we just do, we go down here to sell. Boom. It literally brings it up for you to take a picture. So I'm going to literally just take a picture of this. This is weird holding two cameras. Okay. Take a picture of this shirt. Boom. Okay. And then you hit next. And then literally you're just going to fill out all the information like just about the item and then post it. It's super, super simple. So I'm gonna go through and do all of these and post them up on the site. All right, boom, done. So we've got all of these things here are listed on the Poshmark website. And if anything on there sells, Poshmark will send us a label. They will email it to us and we print it out, attach it to the envelope and then send it out. So they make it super simple. I'm going to just probably leave that here in my closet until something sells or whatnot. And if not, then we'll probably just donate. But that's how that works. I think we're going to do Danny's closet here in a little bit. I might run into the kids room and just see. I'll show you guys. Let's I'll show you what the boys closet looks like and their clothes. It's actually mainly Elijah who gets like an overload of clothes because he gets all of Ethan's like hand-me-downs. So He's got quite a bit, but like I said, I just went through not too long ago and purged, but they're like growing like crazy. I feel like I have to purge like every, I don't know, like two months and they're like already growing out of things. So here's Elijah's closet right here. These are all his clothes. I hang all of their shirts aside from like their pajama shirts just because it's easier for me to keep track of them all. I'm probably going to just go through and make sure there's nothing in here that are too short. Like he's getting some shirts that are like almost belly shirts, but I think this still fits some um, different things. Um, and then I'll put some aside where I, I'm not sure of and have him try them on when he gets home from school. Um, so I'm gonna go through here, probably purge a few things and then see where we're at. All right, so just a few shirts out of his closet. Um, these ones are like almost belly shirts on him now. So I will probably post um, a few of these for sale and then donate a few of those. And then over here, literally their drawer. So I always put Elijah, this is how I remember who's is who's. Elijah's the left side because he's left-handed and then Ethan's the right side. So honestly, they are growing out of like their pants. like. Elijah's legs grow so fast, I feel like. So they're still good on shorts for summer, but like their church pants that are in here, like this, like they're getting so short on him. So I will probably donate a lot of those. And then same for Ethan, um, same, same deal. Like his church pants, they outgrow them so, so fast. So I will probably go through their drawers too. I don't have a ton of time because I got to go get them from school. That's my goal, just to go through these drawers. And then when I have these all emptied out, it's just so much easier to fold all of their laundry and put it away because these drawers are like, you know, they just don't have anything in them. So it's easier to fit all the new clean laundry in there. So I'm gonna go through this real quick, see what we keep, see what we purge, see what we donate, see what we sell. Here we go. I can see your heart pounding like a kick drum. Love it when I'm this drunk. Ooh, yeah, like a firefly burning for you all night. Love it when I'm this high. Ooh, yeah. All right, so Ethan, we do pretty good because anything that doesn't usually fit him we can hand down to Elijah so that actually works really well for us kind of the nice thing of having them like two years apart so anything he that doesn't fit him will hand down to Elijah unless we know that Elijah will not like will absolutely not wear it because sometimes they have different styles of different things they wear and things like that so with with Ethan usually everything is pretty good at being purged out all the time because if it's too small for Ethan I'll just fold it and put it in Elijah's laundry pile and it then becomes Elijah's so usually Elijah and Ashlyn Ashlyn some of her clothes I'll hang on to for Emberlyn just the stuff that I know like might 
stay in style or is going to be still good for when a or Emberlyn becomes Ashlyn's age, which is like years and years. So I'm literally having to save all that stuff. So I'm curious though, like what do you guys do when you guys go through your clothes, spring clean, get, or getting things out, things like that? Like what, what's your system? What do you guys do? I would love any tips, tricks, different things that you guys do and leave it in the comments so that we can all read through them and just kind of get ideas from each other. All right, so just went through Elijah's drawers, found a few things that aren't fitting him anymore. Um, these shorts this is gonna be our donate by pile so um, we have some shorts here and then I always like to donate their church pants because sometimes you know those um, less fortunate um, they have a hard time finding clothes like just nicer church clothes things like that so I like to donate their church pants so I'm gonna do that um, and then we just got some soccer shorts here and then some pajamas and um, another pair of pants, church pants, to donate. And then this will be our sell pile. So donate, sell, and then if they don't sell, we'll donate. So that is it for Elijah's. Honestly, even though it's not a lot, it kind of is. You know what I mean? Like it just feels like any, any little piece of things that we get rid of, it just feels so good. Cause I'm like, man, that's less laundry for me, number one, because it always somehow makes its rounds through the laundry. Cause the kids will try it on and realize it's too small and then they'll throw it into the hamper or whatever. So just to get rid of it, I'm like, okay, this actually feels really good. And just, it's kind of like a, I don't know, just a good kickoff for some spring cleaning, decluttering, things like that. Hey, what's up fam bammers? I'm finally done editing. Oh my goodness. Some days it just takes me longer because when I edit during the day, I mix in my, my regular work in California and the editing here. And it's just kind of a back and forth thing. So it always takes twice as long, but I'm done. Excited for date night. I'm gonna go and get a haircut so I can not wear a hat because I am like, woohoo, look at all that gray. Oh my goodness, it's getting worse, you guys. It's just dust. Oh, it's just really bad dandruff that sticks to hair. I'm getting dusty. Because I dusted the room the other day and it all flew on your head. Yeah, that's true, that's true. Maybe I should shower. So, heading out to do that and excited to go on a date. We're gonna go see, did you already tell what movie? No. Quiet Things and uh it looks so good is that what it's called i think it's quiet it's quiet something okay so, it looks intense i'm a little scared i haven't seen a preview don't know what all i told tina was just remind me to bring my glasses oh yeah because otherwise it's a miserable experience check these guys out jasper hey buddy can i have a hug oh <laughs> Benny boo boo. Oh, 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 Benny, Benny boo 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 boo. Benny's a liquor. Look at that. Oh, man. They're jealous. Woo All right. Hey, fam bammers. So I am back from getting my haircut. Now I'm ready to go on a date. You guys don't understand how much I need to, to go on this date just to have some time with Tina, a couple of friends. We're going to go to movies. We're going to go to Jason's Deli, get some good food, some ice cream. But before we go, I want to show you guys, Tina's been talking to you about Poshmark, and I want to show you guys a couple of items that I'm going to pull from my closet. I'm going to put on there. A um, couple things that I'm, I've chosen not to donate. There's other things that I have that I'm definitely going to donate, but there's some items that, you know, hey, you know what? I think they're great, great condition, and um, I'd like to get at least a little bit of my money back. And I think that's what's awesome about this. It's a great opportunity, not only for us, but for you guys to sell some items of yours, put them out there, as well as shop. It's an awesome place to shop. You guys could buy our stuff, we could buy your stuff, we could buy anyone in there on the market stuff. And it's cool, there's a bunch of parties and boutiques that they have going on there. It's really cool, and if you see something you like, you can also make an offer. So if it's a little high for you, make an offer. If it works out, it works out. I'm gonna show you guys a few things in my closet. As Tina told you before, my closet, are you guys ready to see this? Do you guys remember my closet clean out? Check this out right now. This is the existing condition of it. I did pick it up a little, pick up a little bit in there, but I don't have all of my clothes back in. Tina's been killing the laundry. I don't have them all back in, but here we go. Boom, there's my closet. There's the awesome shoe rack that Paul Fixes Stuff made for me, you guys, and I'm so grateful for him. Go check out that, that video. Go check out his channel, Paul, Paul Fixes Stuff. You'll see him actually making the shoe rack. So, a couple items. This right here, I was going through this, okay, this right here, I'm probably, I'm probably gonna donate this one, this purple one, it was for a soccer team that I had. This one right here, 
I just don't fit into it, you guys. Just don't fit into it. It's a Zoo York, and it just does not fit me well, but it's a nice shirt. So I'm gonna put this one on, and then this one right here as well. Oh man, I wish I could wear this. I ju I've just, I've gotta get in be better shape. This is a Banana Republic right here, this red one. Nice. And I'll put this one on, I'll, you guys will see. And I'll show you guys some of these. Um, you'll see them obviously if you go to Poshmark, but then I'm gonna just take a picture of all of the things that I'm gonna pull. It's only a few, not too, too much. And then we've got this, I'll probably donate that shirt. This one here, this Vans one. This is a nice one, you guys, but once again, doesn't fit me. It fits me a little snug. There, donate that one. A lot of my stuff I want to get rid of, you guys. What do you guys think? Should I should I get rid of this bad boy right here? Do you guys remember that from our um, ugly sweater party when I was hosting? Tina and I were hosting. Boom. I'm definitely going to bust that out next year. I was challenged by so many people to wear that to church for Christmas. And I didn't do it. I don't want to be a distraction at church. I didn't, I don't know. I just didn't feel like it was the right place for it. It, it would have been totally fun. If it was just like an ugly sweater or something, totally cool. But that suit and pants, no way. So check this out. I'm going to show you. These are the, the items that I'm going to put on Poshmark. And I think, you know, hey, I think they're good. They're good items and they're in good shape. And if I could fit into them, honestly, I would be wearing them. So boom, obviously I can, I need to iron these, you guys, but check this out. This is just a cool short sleeve button up shirt from Banana Republic. This is a cool, same thing, my style, just a short sleeve button up shirt. And uh, this one's from Vans. This one's from Zoo York. And same thing, short sleeve button up shirt. These are all size large. It's just a cool way to put some things out there and to share with others. And you can also go, there's other YouTube videos. Um, if you search up Poshmark, you'll see. It's, it's there's a ton of people doing it, you guys. So go check it out. Um, we'll have our stuff up. We'll put all the links and everything down below. It's Friday and you know where Ethan is. Fortnite. You're at number 31. Ooh, he's intense. Look, you guys, he got up off of his seat. Look at that. Are you playing with friends? Oh, so nowadays, like they, the kids, like they play together at the, each at each kids at their own house, and they play like remotely on Fortnite through the microphone, the headset, and all that. So totally different from the way we did it. These women out, boom! What's going on she's here? Not a woman yet? Don't make her grow up. Oh no! Well, she's <laughs> a young woman. Has, yes. Know. She's in Young Women's at the Church. Oh, no. What are you making, Bashi? Making Paschetti. 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 Ooh, we're going to Jason's Deli. There we go with the Sp spaghetti. Paschetti. Sp Ashlyn using her kids in the kitchen experience to make the kids some dinner for date night. And then we always tell Ashlyn if she does babysitting one night, then there's a good chance she'll be able to go out the next night, right? Yep. So hopefully she has plans. And if she doesn't make plans, then she's just lucky enough to hang out with us. <laughs> hey, what's up everybody? So we are back from our date. That was quick, right? But it was awesome. We saw a movie. What was it? Quiet Things? It's called A Quiet Place. Oh, yeah. A Quiet Ooh, Place. Looking cray -cray. A Quiet Place. And that was fun. That like, was crazy. Yeah. That was like a total thriller. You guys go check it out. Yeah. So I think it's kind of advertised as like a horror film kind of. But it's not one of those that you walk away from feeling like gross. gross. Like there's not like murder, like all that stuff. Yeah. But it's definitely a thriller. Like yeah. definitely. And unique to what thrillers are. Yeah, it was it was fun. It was so a different good. kind of movie so and good. definitely worth the watch. Yeah. And it's definitely a date movie. So all of you man crew, take your wife out to go see that movie, especially if you want her to hold your hand. Yeah, serious, <laughs> because she got scared. I was like, yeah, this right on top. <laughs> You were jumping exactly. too. No, I wasn't. Yes, you were. No, I wasn't. You didn't jump at all? No. None. No. Come on. I enjoyed it. I was like, bro. You up. looked at me, you were like. What? Because you. <laughs> she was like. <laughs> I was, I was like, jumping oh, every second. Guys, oh. guys. You guys what? He probably didn't jump because he was asleep the whole time. Hey, oh, be quiet. I watched bird. it. Boy. Jasper, you better tell him to stop, oh, Jasper. A quiet, a quiet place. place. It was pretty cool. Pretty intense. So annoying. Fortnite. What? Oh, Fortnite, no. it was lagging? 
no, no, it was perfect actually. So me, me, and, me and my friend were playing, and then there's this guy on our team who trapped us in the storm, so then we couldn't get out and we died at number three. Oh. <laughs> on your team, why would he do that? He accidentally, he tried to build up on the mountain. Damn, so we've got soccer games at 10.20, 10.30, 1 o'clock, and 2.30. So, and then That's after the that, for us, yeah, and then after that, record. we're hanging out with some friends. We're gonna watch the UFC fight woo, woo, woo. over at How I Nez Rolls. That's right. So now Ashlyn and I are gonna go oh, by. Oh, it's oh. what? It's almost ten at night. We gotta go by one of the soccer players' homes to pick up a jersey, and then we're gonna go get some ice cream. All right, hey you guys, closing out. Kids are just now getting settled. We got, Weekend. We've got half of them in bed. In our bed. Yes, so we're gonna have to move them. <laughs> yes, we will. So guys, good day today. I do feel like we were very productive, got a lot done. I was able to purge quite a bit out of the closets today. Now we just need to spend, I think you got a few things out. We've got a few of yours yeah. listed. I got like four, maybe four or five things, that's yeah. it. Yeah, that's... that's why he has too many clothes. So I think we need a full day to go through all of Danny's clothes to make the donate, sell, and keep pile. Yeah, that'd be fun. Let's do it. I'm up for it. Me and too. because once you do it, then you're you're basically setting yourself up for new clothes. So is that how that works? Yeah. Sweet. So I'm done. Does that mean I go to go shopping? Well, how many clothes items did you take out? Shopping. A lot. And you took out five uh, of yours. No. Of mine? Uh -huh. Way more than that. So whatever amount like ten. Whatever items she took out, then those are the items that she gets to replace, right? I like it. So we have 19 total items that we put on our on our Poshmark um, closet. So out of those 19, I don't think you have 10. Because I, I probably I have five. I think I do. The kids probably have five, 10. So maybe you have nine or something. Yeah, close to it. <laughs> he can't say 10. He's like, oh, maybe it's nine. Maybe you have nine and a half or 9.99. <laughs> oh. So, yeah, but you know what? It's funny. It's actually kind of fun. Maybe it's because you just take pictures and set it up and you make your own price. So easy. Yeah, it's totally fun. So, so easy. It's, That's why I like it. It's mindless, so you don't even have to think about it. You yeah. You just take the picture, put it all in, boom, it's up. So. Yeah. And it's not just clothes. You could do shoes. You could do hats. You I feel could like you're going to hit me in the face with your hands. Yeah, you could do pretty much anything that you want. <laughs> So, like, yeah. <laughs> and so just go check out the Poshmark app and see the different items and things that you could sell on there. And you could also shop and buy. So, yeah, really cool app, you guys. Go ahead. We're going to leave a link down in the description below that'll take you directly to the app to upload it. Check it out. Just, it's worth just checking out. It's free. It's free. Um, just go check it out. See if you like it. See if it's something that you're interested in. Like I said, super, super easy. I like it. Yeah. So, and comment down below since we're in, we did a speed cleaning the other day. We just did the purging, like the co the closet uh, clothing clean out. Um, comment down below and let us know what what cleaning or yeah what cleaning or decluttering area would you guys like to see next? Ex aside from the garage, we're not doing the garage right now. <laughs> I don't have time for that right now. <laughs> That's gonna so, take us like 72 aside from hours. That, um, oh my gosh. Comment down below and let us know what area you want or just let us know maybe a different type of video that you think you would be interested in seeing us do. Yeah, but I kind of want to keep going on these spring cleaning room by room type things. Yeah. So um, I could really do any room because they all need them, so. Yeah, so thanks for watching you guys. Tomorrow we've got soccer games. Um, it could be, we, we're, we'll record, we'll make a vlog tomorrow. Yeah. And Ashlyn last year, the team oh. that we're playing tomorrow, Ashlyn literally got slapped in the face by one of the girls. Like it got, uh, it yeah. got ugly. I've never seen anything like it. We so. might have even mentioned it in one of our vlogs, but yeah. previous, but it's going to be an intense game. We're going to definitely have the camera on during it. Yes. And, uh, and the other kids, they have their games as well. So we're going to be on the soccer field from 1020 until probably 3.30 or 4 o'clock. It's going to be a long soccer day. Yeah. Um, but we'll take you guys along with us. And then we uh, have fight night tomorrow night too. Yeah. So we'll show you all the delicious food that's going to be over at How I Nez Rolls. Ooh. Yeah. You know it's going to be good. Yeah. That's it, you guys. Thanks so much for watching. Thanks for all your love, for all your support. And that's it. We're calling it a night, guys. We're going to bed. So we'll see you guys tomorrow. And don't forget, choose your day. You got three to do. 
Let me tell you this, let me tell you right now Your exquisite kiss still burning Didn't know I missed this passion in life Now I'm addicted So now let me tell you why What is up with your smile? It's impossible, not melting Irresistible when I look through your eyes Not